These are the coolest things I saw at NTT Upgrade 2025. Let's go. Building space data centers where data could actually be stored in space, use AI to make predictions and determinations on what's really valuable and prioritize that, beam it back down to Earth data centers for retrieval and processing. That's gonna become really important as the number of satellites increases. Okay, we've seen AI-powered robot dogs like this before. Robotics is fascinating all by itself. But what NTT is doing is building a layer on top of that. Imagine if this dog could go out to your site, check out gauges, instruments, get measurements, record it digitally, and then send it back. Finally, there's Photonics. Now, NTT is probably most known for their ION, which is their integrated optical and wireless network. Now, obviously, we already have fiber optic cables now under the ocean. My internet comes over fiber optics. But then when it gets to your computer, it's all copper. What they're trying to do is roll out a phase system where more and more of our compute happens over optical cables powered by light and lasers instead of copper. For example, to start, we can start with board to board, finally package to package and die to die, meaning like inside the chip, the different parts of the chip could all be connected via optical cables. And the benefit of that is lower latency, higher bandwidth, and lower power consumption. And in an age where AI data centers are taking over, that part is really huge. But this is just the tip of the iceberg. NTT Research is doing tons of R&D on everything from AI, robotics, healthcare, and so much more. So if you want to learn more, check out the links in the description.